Hey everyone, Mr. Browning M1911 here today, and hopefully lucky. I got some stuff in my tray here. And today I'm going to do another uh, comparison, but this one's going to be a little bit more fun. Both meals are from 2014, and I just kind of wanted to have a little fun with this one here. Okay. The first one here, ah, let's go with this one here. First one here is menu number 17, pork sausage patty, maple flavor. And the other one is menu number 20, pork sausage and cream gravy. So kind of both of these are breakfast menus. And I, I just wanted to, I thought this would be a cool idea. Now one thing I do notice here, these are both 2014, but the packaging on these two are different. All right, this, is the, this one here is of the older packaging, this one's of the newer packaging. So I'm figuring that they switched over to this style of rubberized packaging in 2014 and still had some of the old packs. And this, these are dated 2014. So let's go ahead and open up the 2000, or, <laughs> sorry, the menu number 17 here, the maple sausage. Lucky will probably show up here, and then we'll do the uh, menu number 20 here. Okay. Uh. All right, let's see what we got here. We got our little heater holder. We got some crackers. Our accessory packet. Ration heater, spoon, hot beverage bag, regular cheese spread, nut raisin mix, and here's our muffin top, maple muffin top, and our pork sausage patty. Over here we got our crackers, another famous Russian heater, accessory packet, MRE spoon, and this one here we also have just a regular cheese spread, our hot beverage bag, here we have lemon lime flavored beverage, and oh we have a chocolate banana nut muffin top. All right, two muffin tops. And here is our sausage and gravy. And our, of course, our little heater holder. And then this one here, we get dehydrated granola with milk and blueberries. That's gonna be a good one. I'm gonna eat this one a little uh, with warm water. So let's go ahead and get our stuff heated up here. Now in my last video, I had camera issues and I lost some footage. So hopefully this time it doesn't happen. I'm gonna try to go a little quicker that this time get things going but I would have to say these are probably out of all of the MRE meals these two will probably have to be my most favorite where did I put it? there it is Okay. A little bit more. Right there.
Oh yeah, that's heating up real nice. If you can hear it. Okay. Set that one there. Doesn't want to work right. That's too high. There we go. And that's just right. Those two are heating up. There we go. Let's go through the accessory packets here. Quite a bit of stuff in here, it looks like. All right, we get our cinnamon gum, coffee, instant type three our sugar, non-dairy creamer, our matches, we get an orange beverage base type 3 sugar free, our moist towelette, our napkins, and table syrup. All right, I'll go ahead and move those off to the side there. sauce in any of these it looks like napkins sugar and salt the towelette and non-dairy creamer matches again type 3 coffee and our chewing gum and yeah there is no hot sauce which I think probably would have gone great with this especially with the, the uh, cream gravy and the uh, sausage. All right, let's go ahead and make up our granola with blueberries and milk. And there you go. You can see all the dehydrated blueberries in there. Granola and whatever else is in there. water. Mix it up here and it's got a nice blue tint to it. Okay let's go ahead and make up the coffees. Oh yeah those smell really good. Here's our coffee, basically the same, same year. Non-dairy creamer. I don't think this creamer would go bad in just two years. All right. There's no hot chocolate in any of these. over here and now for our drink mixes I guess 
I didn't get that one open right. There we go. You can definitely see the difference between the two. You get a whole lot more powder in this one here than you do this one. mixes for now. All right, let's get into the muffin tops. Gotta love those muffin tops. All right, that's the maple. Chocolate banana. Ooh, it's falling apart on me. Uh, Nut maple or not maple, sorry, muffin. <laughs> so there we go. Raisin nut mix, no explanation there. Standard raisins and nuts, not very many raisins in there, a lot more nuts. Okay, now the crackers. they come out all in one piece and ooh they are slightly cracked but did come out all in one piece and voila oh that one broke but again one piece okay so cheese For lucky. Ah. The whole bag ripped, so we're gonna get a nice big piece of cheese here. That's okay. Oh wow, that's really greasy. Mm. I'll set that there. Cheese is cheese. Yeah, this cheese is really greasy. Wow, very oily. Okay, well, let's go ahead and try the crackers. Of course, without any cheese on it. Yeah, see, they fall apart real easy. That's why I, like, I always say I like the older style crackers better because they hold up better. And they definitely taste like fresh crackers, wonderful crackers. Mm-hmm. The cheese is good. I'm gonna go lucky. Both cheeses are good. Really good. Okay. Let's see how our pork sausage patty turned out. It's nice and warm. Oh, 
just spilled it all over myself. Yeah, that's nice and warm. And there is your pork sausage patty. Looks like it was already on the grill once. Move that out of the way there. Ooh, yeah, this is really hot. Mm. Wiping it on my leg there. All right. <laughs> Doesn't look like he approves of the cheese very much. Oh, that smells really good. That is a really nice creamy gravy. You can see the pork sausage in there, that's really nice. And came out really nice. All right, I'm gonna do it the way I like to do it here. I take the uh, pork, actually I put that on the bottom. Good thing I haven't had breakfast yet. All right, and some syrup. All right. Okay, well, let's just take a taste test here. See how this pork sausage, cream gravy tastes. Really need some hot sauce with this. Oh yes, hot sauce would be awesome. There's a sausage patty with muffin top. Mm. Really good. Let's try the granola with the blueberry. Oh yeah, that thickened up real nice. Get a nice hearty helping there. Unfortunately, it's bland. So, what I'll do is I'm going to add a little bit of sugar to it. Okay. Mix that up. Let's try it again. Oh, yeah. Definitely the sugar helps. The menu number 20 coffee is good. And the menu 17 coffee is good. <laughs> Basically the same. Oh, just kicked my own camera. Sorry. And now for the lemon lime. Yeah, that's really good. Oh, that orange drink. Mm. And now for... The chocolate banana nut muffin top. Look how that looks on the inside there. Mmm. That is really good. Crumble some of that up in there into the uh, when I was in the Navy we had a cook that liked to make biscuits and chocolate gravy. I would never had that before until you made it and I fell in love with it. Mm. 
Mmm. That's actually pretty good. Let's try the raisins and nuts. Yeah. They taste really good. Now for the cinnamon gum. Really good. And now to really screw with my taste buds, the peppermint. Mm-hmm. Really good. Now I can safely say out of all this, these two sausage meals by far are my most favorite out of every single MRE I've had with the exception of one. Um, the old uh, barbecue pork and rice, which I do have, and I'll probably do a review on that one, that was my favorite MRE of all time. These two definitely take number two. They are delicious. I mean, although, like I said, that this could use some hot sauce in there. But it is really good. With the exception of the orange sugar-free drink, like I said, I don't really like sugar-free stuff. It's just a weird taste. Um, but crackers, cheese, perfect. Nuts were great. This right here makes the whole meal and same with this one here so I hope you enjoyed this review of menu number seven team uh, uh, maple pork sausage patty and menu number 20 uh, pork sausage and cream gravy definitely from 2014 both of them were perfect and Please like the video if you like what you saw. Please share, comment, or leave a comment down below. If you didn't like it, well, there's nothing I can do about that. And uh, Or at least leave a comment down below. Tell me where I can improve and do anything like that. And if you like our channel, please subscribe. This is Mr. Browning M1911. And Lucky, have a wonderful day. Out.